Hello everyone, Ryan here. I'm back with another album review. This time I'll be reviewing Undertow, which is the first official full-length album by the band Tool. And it was released sometime in 1993. So I'll go ahead and give the track listing and then talk about five of my favorites from this album. So, first track is titled Intolerance. It is four minutes, 54 seconds long. Second track is Prison Sex. It is four minutes, 56 seconds long. Third is Sober, a very popular song. It is five minutes, seven seconds long. Fourth track is titled Bottom. It is seven minutes, 14 seconds long. Fifth is Crawl Away. It is five minutes, 30 seconds long. Six is Swamp Song. It is five minutes, 32 seconds long. Seventh is Undertow, the title track, of course. It is five minutes, 22 seconds long. Eighth is titled Four Degrees, and it is six minutes, three seconds long. Ninth is Flood. It is titled Seven Minutes. Uh, crap. What did I say titled? <laughs> Ninth is Flood. It is uh, seven minutes, 46 seconds long. And the last track is really has no title. It's just Silence, but it's uh, kind of an interesting thing that, that the band decided to do where... It's, uh, it, they added this, like, silence in, in, like, one second intervals. So, like, every one second, after a second, then it starts another second, and then another, another second goes by, another second. Uh, and then it get, eventually gets to the hidden track. I think, I would say, last time I listened to it, I think sometime between, like, after, like, 69 seconds or something like that, close to 69 seconds then the hidden track starts and it's really it's it's definitely a very experimental track it's not really a song I guess you could say though at the same time as far as Tool is concerned you could consider it a, a classic Tool song uh, there's a, a it's it's got like a repeating phrase throughout the whole thing about uh, it starts with uh, this is necessary, this is necessary, uh, life feeds on life, life feeds on life, life feeds on life. <laughs> Which uh, is very simple, very uh, succinct, uh, very profound. Again, I believe like I mentioned before in my review of Opiate, uh, just another example of how profound uh, Maynard's lyrics can be so so yeah uh my five favorites off of this album my, as far as those are concerned my fifth favorite would definitely have to be crawl away i like the the guitar riffs in that song uh my fourth favorite would be flood yeah flood i like that it starts really slow and then it eventually picks up uh, which a lot of Tool songs do that. But since this is, I believe this is probably the first one, first Tool song, uh, especially off of this album, since it is their first full-length album, I believe it, uh, Flood is their first song that starts very slow and then eventually builds up. Uh, of course, eventually later on, on their other albums, they ended up... Uh, writing recording a number of similar songs to Flood. So that's my fourth favorite. My third favorite is definitely Four Degrees. I like how it starts with this like really short intro. Uh, sometimes you can hear it, although definitely of course I've noticed that uh, if you listen to if you listen to Tool, any of Tool's albums through headphones, uh, it's easier to notice a lot of very subtle, subtle things that that they've added into the overall mix. 
Whereas if you listen to them on a car stereo or any other stereo, anything that isn't headphones, actually, uh, it's hard to to really, I guess, absorb the the subtleties of the very uh, of Tool songs. So, yeah, Four Degrees is my third favorite. My second favorite is definitely Intolerance. I like that this is the first track on this album. Uh, I believe they chose wisely. In fact, I believe uh, Tool, they also, they're one of those uh, few bands that, uh, that really know how to uh, set the order of the tracks, of each track on their album, each song, I should say. Uh, so yeah, Intolerance, I like that. It opens the album. Uh, and again, I like the guitar riffs, powerful guitar riffs. I also like the bass riffs in this. Uh, I believe this is when they still, uh, their original bass player was still playing with them. And yeah, because that guy, and I forget his name exactly. I want to say Paul something. Paul something, I don't know. I might be mistaken. I might be mistaken for their current bass player, but uh, but at that time, their bass player at that time, he played bass more like you would play uh, guitar. In fact, I remember I read one time in an interview with them that originally, uh, before the, before starting this band, the guitar player uh, Adam Jones, Tool's guitarist, before uh, joining Tool or even starting tool uh he had played a lot of bass in other bands and the bass player again before joining tool he mostly played guitar and then they decided to switch switch it up pretty much just i don't really really know how they decided on it i guess they both wanted to explore uh other instruments so adam jones switched from he went from bass to guitar uh, and then the other guy too, he went from guitar to bass. So and I think uh, you can really hear it. I mean, if you pay if you pay enough attention, you can tell that the bass player is, you know, he's playing bass like you would a guitar. Which, in my opinion, is awesome. So, uh, so yeah, uh, Intolerance is my second favorite. My first favorite, my number one favorite off of this album. Uh, it's not sober. It's <coughs> uh, I could have easily gone with sober, but no. My my f number one favorite off of this album is Undertow, the title track. Uh, I liked it. It's to me, it's got like a, a very good balance of uh, heavy guitar riffs and also some melodic riffs, and then of course combined with. The, the very profound, once again, the very profound lyrics of Major, Major James Keenan. Uh, yeah, so that's that's it, you know. Uh, again, my fifth favorite is Crawl Away, fourth favorite Flood, third favorite Four Degrees, second favorite Intolerance, first favorite Undertow. Yeah. Uh, and of course, it's not to say that uh, I don't like the other songs off of this album, because I do, I like the entire album. Uh, and I do like Sober, it's just that, I don't know, for me, sometimes I'm in a mood to listen to it, other times not so much, uh, and then of course, the, I kind of feel like, as far as uh, the local music scene here in my city, uh, in El Paso, Texas, there's a lot of bands, well, mostly a lot of cover bands that, you know, they, they pretty much have played, they've covered sober uh pretty much to death by now so uh yeah i don't know I, I think that usually tends to happen with me if a band if too many bands cover a particular song then for me it starts to lose its edge a little bit and then i have to allow a certain amount of time to pass before uh, i'm willing to listen to it again so 
I don't know. That's that's just me. It might it might also have a lot to do with the fact that uh, that I'm a musician myself, and you know, yeah, I don't know. Uh, so overall, on a scale of one metal horn to five metal horns, I give this album Undertow by Tool. I give it a definite five metal horns. Definitely, yeah. So that'll do it for this album review. Uh, thanks again. For watching, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, all that good stuff. Thank you, everybody who is currently subscribed. I definitely appreciate it. And as always, till next time, keep it real, keep on rocking, and peace.